So what is up everyone this is Kiran here welcome back to Tech Kiran YouTube channel One OS which the weekly update is available for many devices but we are not gonna talk about the weekly update for other devices like Redmi Note 8 and some other devices we are gonna talk about the stable update for Redmi Note 9s, Redmi Note 9 Pro and Poco X3 in my case I tried it on my Poco X3 and Redmi Note 9 Pro both of the devices from Poco X3 I'm making this video while I was using this build on my device. Things are almost same. I thought I should share with you my opinions about this one. It will show you MIUI 1221.6.3 which is actually not. It's just MIUI 12 stable based. They just showing you the new version here alongside with that they also have some little bit of extra changes which we're gonna talk about here in this video. It also comes with the OTA updates option so yes you can update via OTA. I haven't tried the OTA update yet and I will always recommend you to use clean flash but yes if you always update and if you know how to update and everything else you can give it a try i'm not sure so that's why i'm not recommending you we also have this that we have android version 11 in redmi note 9s and redmi note 9 pro if which means if you're using cortana so you will get android 11 but if you using poco x3 you will get android and it's not android 11 this is the only change but everything else is just same for example we have the about one OS information donate you can donate them if you want to if you like the room you can but it's up to you i'm not recommending you we also have the new power menu and this is almost same in poco xc and redmi note 9 pro it's almost same here you're using miui 12 but you have this new volume panel by default sometimes when i saw that it was four side power four side volume panel where we got notification ringtone and maybe two more but here we only have these three so it's just normal but this is a new one this is updated one which we have right now on our device you might get update very very soon but right now this is what we have right now lock screen etc has the same kind of features display sound and vibration etc has nothing to talk about almost same features are there this is not being 12.5 or 12.6 as i previously mentioned you so all the MIUI 12 features are present for you sound assistant if you are using android 11 in android 10 you don't get this feature additional settings etc has the same kind of options for you notification shade also includes expand top notification which is actually available in xiaomi eu so it's actually rebased on xiaomi eu with some little bit of extra enhancements or maybe better than and better than Xiaomi you in the terms of performance I got it we also have the styles customizations for you you can use the custom styles which is good I'm not sure if you get this in MIUI 12 but yes the option is present for you I just got this so I thought I should share with you everything else is same home screen wallpaper seems even in if you go to the wallpaper section you also have some super wallpapers pre-installed which shouldn't be there but yes these are present if you're looking to install super wallpapers these are available pre-installed for you you can also update them i haven't updated it yet i'm not sure if it will update or not but if it would update that's very good that's actually quite good also it has the new power menu available for you both of the devices have this power menu the new one OS power menu which looks normal normal kind of unique good it's all about your preferences but looks quite good you can simply switch turn on turn off turn on turn off is present at down turn on present at up sorry reboot is present at up everything else is same including there let's talk about some other features for example if you go here the performance etc seems to be normal here in the theme section you don't get the one OS theme back i was looking for that unfortunately the one OS theme still not there wallpapers it also includes some one OS wallpapers for you which looks quite good and doesn't have any kind of extra features customizations almost everything seems to be same here let's talk about some other extra things which you get here for example as I previously mentioned you, you have the OTA update. So if you want to update you simply need to open the updater app and you will find there and also in the control center you don't have that swipe option between swipe notifications and control center because that's only available in MIUI 12.5 Android 11. This is Android 11 but this is MIUI 12. The control center speed is actually good as you can see the swipe down speed is actually good. The performance seems to be decent enough. One OS space is also included. If you want to install this build on your device, installation is quite simple. Install, zip, format data and reboot. This is all. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Have a nice day.
over the edge Feel like I'm floating through the air 